So we're still on 3E part 3 and we're going to start building this macro. What we're going to do is we're going to start with the easy part of the macro first. And the easy part of the macro is going to be to set the variable, which will be that bit, ignore all of these bits about asking if the instructors, cars or learners are available. And then we're going to say, is that variable yes? If it is, go through this process. And so what it will do is this macro will always book the lesson okay, and give the confirmation message. So that will be the confirmation message and that will be booking the lesson. And the reason it will, it's going to do that is because all we're doing at this stage is setting the variable to be yes. So we've got this button called check booking that links to this check booking macro. So we need to edit this check booking macro. The first thing we need to do is we need to set this variable to be yes. So we're going to use the, uh, this option here called set local var. And we're going to call the local var, local variable that is, lesson available. And we're going to set it to be yes. And we're going to put that in speech marks because that's what we want it to be. So we're going to set it to be equal to yes. Now we'll come down here, because we're missing out all of that bit at the moment, and we're going to do this bit, which says, is the lesson available? So if we're asking a question, we're putting an if block in. Now, if isn't in alphabetical order, because it's actually uh, a set of commands that we're going to put in there. So if, okay, and we're going to say, if that variable is yes. Now the way that we do this is we say, if, Local vars, you see it's come up with local vars for us. Use our exclamation mark again, and it's going to be if local vars less than available equals yes in speech marks, then we're going to have an action that will confirm the lesson has been booked. So that will be a message box. So we'll have a message box here. The message will say the lesson has been booked and we'll give it a title called lesson booked and the next action is going to be to add the lesson record to the lesson table so that's going to be to run that append query so we want this one to open a query so there's open query and what is the name of the query that we want to open it's going to be called the lesson booking query. Okay, so we'll save that macro. Let's run it and see what it does. Let's make sure we've got our form open. We have. Okay, so we'll run this macro. Right, we expect that to happen because lesson available is set to yes. It then says, is the lesson available? If it does, it will book the lesson. It will give a confirmation message. Then it will run the query. So if we now have a look at the lesson table, there's our data. Let's delete that. And what we can also do is we can check whether this button works. It does. Okay, because all it does is runs the macro. We'll just close that lesson table down. Just remind you what we did. We've missed out the middle part okay, of this flowchart and we started off by saying set this variable to be yes called lesson available so set local variable lesson available to be yes we miss out the next bit we then say is that local variable yes in other words is is it possible to book that lesson so we're saying is that local variable if that local variable called lesson available is equal to yes then display this message there's our thing to display the message and also add the lesson record to the lesson table well here's that here's the query the query called the lesson booking which was an append query which adds it so that's the easy part of the macro the next video tutorial is going to show you how to create each of these okay if statements to decide if an instructor is available if they are nothing will happen. If they're not, it's going to set this lesson available to be no, so that we don't go through this process and book. 
because what we want it to do is say if less than available is yes do this otherwise do nothing so it will only do this if that is still yes